Hello guys, Yusha Steve here, and with me today is... Kikori! Yes, today is going to be a Yusha and Kikori plays. No villager A, because I've got to ask him if he wanted to do this, and he is totally going to be totally upset that we're doing this without him. But we're playing Fire Emblem Path, Path of Radiance! Yes, I'm gonna, and we're going to have Kikori play it. The most unskilled Fire Emblem player in existence. We're gonna have the best worst time together, guys. Hell yeah, and after Path of Radiance is Radiant Dawn. Woo! That's gonna be even worse! Oh shit, look how serious EK is. Uh, new game? Yeah, you'd have to new game. <laughs> so I'm like, oh shit, there's a lot of options. You ain't no pussy. Do normal mode at least. You know, shit, you're right. <laughs> what kind of bitch does easy mode? Me. <laughs> the bitch. I'm honest at least. Oh shit. Ike's about to die. You're already about to lose a character. Get good. Missed her opportunity. Missed his opportunity. Oof. <laughs> Get good, Ike. Ike's dead. Now Mist is the main character. Oh shit, that sucks. Why is my mouse on the screen? <laughs> Mr. <Mist of> Radiance. <laughs> Oh shit, it's my favorite fireman character. I don't know who that is. I don't either, I've never played this before. Was I asleep for a hundred years? Yeah, probably. Yeah, I just saved Tellius from uh, Gamble Dork. Yep. Ike of the Wild. <laughs> Missed that song. Ah, you're up. <laughs> About time. God damn. Quality. <laughs> and intelligence systems always delivers quality. <laughs> damn right. Forget you that my. <laughs> That's pretty good, honestly. Yeah. Are you all right? <clears throat> yeah, I'll be fine. I'm Mike. So, the sleeping prince awakens. Uh, actually, Ike isn't a prince. Not yet, he's not. Father, I can't believe you. I know those are practice swords, but they're still heavy. You you have no right to be so rough on Ike. Yeah, he does. If this is too much for the boy, he would never make it as a mercenary. But, no buts. Miss, you don't have to worry. I told you, I'm fine. Ha! Huh. You'd better be. Now grab your sword and get ready. What? Don't tell me you're going at it again. What? Just until I, I land a single blow. I'm not giving up until I can get one good hit in on Father. I like your resolve, Ike, but it takes more than a strong will to, hmm? Aha! I knew I'd find you here. It's my boy, Boyd. You Boyd or believe it. <laughs> you Boyd or believe it? I'm here, I'm Boyd. My boy, who brings you here? <laughs> Nothing special. You said you were going to get the boss, but you never came back. I, I got picked to check up on you. Oh, sorry. I got caught up with Ike and my father. It's nothing. Besides, I figured I'd get a good laugh watching Ike get worked over by the boss. Uh, I'm sure, I'm sure some people would get more than good laughs from that. Oh yeah. You look fine. You okay. like Ike? Everyone likes Ike. <laughs> Ike like Ike! Ike like Bike! <laughs> what happened? Nothing at all. I'm sorry to disappoint you. 
You just missed it. Just a minute ago, he was out cold. Yeah. Missed. Ah, uh, sorry. Hee <laughs> hee. You came at just the right time, Boyd. You can be Ike's sparring partner. What? Me? Fuck enough. I'm beginning to think it would be better if he sparred with someone closer to his own skill. Damn! They just take a shot at Boyd? Damn! <laughs> Dude! <clears throat> I understand. Thanks for your help, Boyd. Hmm. I don't know about this closer to his skill business, but I'm ready! Yeah, you're right. You're probably worse than I. <clears throat> All right, I'm ready for you. Let's go. Yeah, there's a place to the game. Drawer windows like this will appear from time to time. Anna, your helpful hint girl, will explain and demonstrate any new features. Hell yeah, dude. If you want to watch tutorial again, simply choose guide from the map menu. Use tutorial. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> for the love of God. Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Click on him? No, click on Boyd. Oh, you said click on him. Click on him. There you go. Okay, now go back to Ike. Okay. Now, end your turn and see if he moves towards you. <laughs> I remember how this map is programmed. Yeah, click. Wait, okay. Hey, what's the hold up? Let's get started already. Okay, he did not move towards you. I'm coming. Wait right there. <laughs> okay. Well, I guess that explains that he's going to wait exactly right there. So go ahead and just move right forward. I ain't going to be a bitch around up to him. Wait. Hurry, Hurry up, up, will you? Or, or are, are you afraid, afraid of, of me? me? Okay, so now go behind him and cut his head off. This is about right. Yeah. You boy to believe this bitch. So he's eight to your nine. You, you can, can do it. Boyd's got nothing to kill. <laughs> Jesus Christ. That's this savage, <laughs> miss. Oh my god. The boy just comes there and gets shit on by the whole family. <laughs> nothing. I don't have nothing. Uh, I mean... Uh, I have. I. I mean. <coughs> you boy to believe he's all flustered. Haha! <laughs> I'm not done yet. We're just getting started. He crits you. Did if you know refam? If he crits me, I'm. I'm just. Oh, he didn't even attack you. Just fucking kill him. You should do nine damage. Does it matter if I go behind him or no? No. Okay. So I'm just to disguise. Okay, now you lose Boyd. You actually didn't have. You actually shouldn't have killed him there. Good game. Okay, that's cool. I'll solo the whole game with Ike. <laughs> you actually can. What is that? That. That wasn't too bad. Boyd, Boy, you're such a loser. <laughs> Damn! A <laughs> boy just needs to quit. Just can't kill himself. Jesus. Shut your trap. Oh no, he can't say that. Good work, Boyd. That's enough. Get out of my mercenary group. Why the fuck are you here? Oh, alright. Get out of here, boy. No one wants you. Your sword is New, leveling up. That didn't exist in any Fire Emblem game before this. Uh, no, this is brand new to this game. I have no idea how leveling up works. I've never played an RPG before. <laughs> Your swordsmanship was decent enough, I. But d don't forget how it felt. It won't always be this easy. <laughs> Jesus Christ, it's a skin. It's on me, boy. Just uh, get boy some aloe, dude, for all these burns he's getting. I know. I know. God. Oh, my God, I... You know, saying nothing is usually better than saying, you know, something mean. Oh, my God. Now that you're done warming up, it's time for you to fix <laughs> me again. Oh, my boy, just... Oh. I was hoping you'd say that. But first, missed! Right here! Where else would she be? She's standing right fucking next to him. Here you go, Ike. It's a vulnerary. You got a vulnerary. Da -da -da -da. I'd recommend using it now before you fight Father. Last time, he knocked you silly. Oh, come on, Mitch. You gotta say it to my face? That's mean, girl. Damn right.
always take time to heal your wounds in a battle, even small ones. That's uh, a great yeah, because you never know where you get crit by the dude who has a 1% chance to miss after you hit your 99% chance to hit. Look, hashtag good advice grail. By the time you think you're in trouble, it's probably too late. Don't get into that situation. I'm always in that situation. Items. Uh, no. <laughs> Turn tree. Get ready, Ike. Here I come! Oh, he's actually coming to you. Oh, shit. Uh, oh, Dad? I oh, he went straight to you, dude. Give it your all! It's about a 7 to your 8. It's not bad. Come on, boy! You're going to give me a challenge this time around? Dun, dun, dun. So, actually, it'd probably be better... To end your turn and let him attack you, and then you kill him on your next turn. Because I think if you attack him here, he'll kill you on his turn. Should I heal or just do nothing? I mean, yeah, you could heal. I don't think you have to heal, though. But maybe he'll crit you, which would suck dicks. Look, I gotta be overly cautious, dude. What if he crits me? Now, I'm gonna go behind him and literally stab him in the back. <laughs> there you go, that's how you do things. Bye, Dad. Oh. So traumatic. <laughs> I just hit you in the back, Dad. Should give me two more XP. What is this level up thing? Is this the new thing they were talking about that's in this game? Dude, you're a ranger! You should beat him up with a sword instead of a bow! Hell yeah, dude! Ike is so cool, he would probably just, like, <laughs> shoot a sword at you with a bow. Wait, I think you're actually a forest ranger. You protect a wired lot. Okay, so I'm in the forest covenant, okay. Uh, Ike, you are great! Father, you were holding back, weren't you? What? Is that true? Well, yeah. If you could tell a difference, that means you're improving. You know, I wasn't really giving it mile either. Uh, boy, <laughs> uh, boy, boy, do you shit on you? Don't, don't, don't make it worse for yourself. Boy, look, <laughs> I would just stop talking if I were you. That is such a lie. Look, even Mist can see through that. Bah. So, Father, does that mean you finally admit that I'm ready? What? To join the company? To take on a job? Yeah. I mean, Boyd's already out there on the battlefield. I'm ready. I'm tired of being a trainee. Listen, the difference between you and me is that I'm a professional. Who just got my ass kicked and shit on. Look, he's a professional <laughs> punching bag. First he got smacked around by Grail, and then Ice came around like... Psh, just There's a lot of enemies here, if only we have a distraction. Boyd's here, Boyd! Go get them! Oh yeah, I'm gonna show you how strong I am. Ah! Uh, ah! Oh, I'm getting beat up! Oh, good job! You're doing a good job, boy! You're really showing them! Okay, let's go complete the mission. Yeah. They're distracted. <coughs> a professor just got beat. Oh my god, this <laughs> just mm, laying on the smack! We're gonna have to edit some bone hills into this. Hell yeah, dude. That was just random chance. Random chance! I didn't see a crit. You've got a point, Ike. Alright, tomorrow will be your first day as a full fledged mercenary. Really? No. No, just kidding. Get the fuck out. Nah, just kidding, just kidding. But, if I think it's too much, you're back to trainee status. You'd better work hard, boy. No problem. Watch. I'll catch up everyone in no time. You boy or believe it. <laughs> boy, you I think it's going to be the next Grail Hokage, people. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. We'll see. We'd better be heading back to the fort. Everyone's waiting. No, I'm not saving. I'm gonna beat the whole game in one run. Hmm. 
mercenary Ford. What other kind of Ford is there? I don't know. Uh, Fortress Fort? Yeah, Fort Fort. Fort Fort. Good morning, Ike. Today's your first day as a professional soldier, isn't it? Yeah, and I'm ready to go. Well, you are is late. The others are suited up and ready at the break of dawn. Sorry, I'll get up early from now on. So, what's my first job? Literally, you. <laughs> I'm talking with Titania right now. Wait outside until we're done. Everyone else is up. Oh, hold on, it's still too early. It's 8 p.m. Don't wake me up. <laughs> <laughs> He's such a teenager, dude. Yes, sir. Very well, Commander Grail. Shall we continue? Uh, no, we'll just wait until the end of the game to continue this. You are telling me about some bands that need taken care of, weren't you? Correct. The request comes from a nearby village. According to a report, the bands are not all that strong. I think it best if I ride out and take a look. I plan on taking Oscar and Boyd along with me. Boy, my boy. Well, he's a distraction, dude. Just the brothers? Oh, I, Oscar must be super cool if Boyd's this lame. Mm, <laughs> go ahead and add I to your team. Shinon, Gatri, and I can handle the other two jobs easily enough. Tatiana, I'm leaving Ike in your care. I'm trusting you to show him the ropes. Understood, Commander. Come on, Ike, let's get you set up. Alright, oh, my, my first, first job. job. I'm so proud of you. Captain Tatiana, preparation's ready. Uh, complete, and I'm ready to go. Impeccable timing. It's nice to know we can always count on you to be at the ready, Oscar. Who else is going to count on Boyd? A boy's just doing his best to not get shit on every battle. <laughs> and after he comes home, Mitch will take a huge dump on him. Don't forget about me. I'm ready for action. Is that so, Boyd? That's a surprise. Ha! Not today it isn't. As of today, I'm going to be the absolute model perfection. I need to set a good example for Ike. I'll take your word for it. Your first campaign at last. I know you've wanted this for a while. Are you nervous, Ike? I think I was more nervous last night. I could hardly sleep. This morning, oh. I'm feeling pretty good. Is the for the story. <laughs> I was pretty nervous last night. <laughs> Just try to relax. You're not going to be out there alone. Yeah, you're right. Right? Everyone ready? Let's go. <clears throat> Brigands. Dastards. Alright, let me explain what's going on. What the fuck is going on? This is a map of Kalia. They've hired us to drive off some bandits. Where okay. are the blue marks here? Okay. Are they listening? The red dots are the bandits. Oh, hold up. Okay, okay, so red is enemies and blue is allies. It's pretty okay. game breaking, but I think I got it. Yeah, there aren't many of them, but we can't get careless. The one on the front of the building up north is their leader. He would never move, ever. You can literally run up there and beat him up. Watch out for their leader, he's pretty dangerous. Our mission is to take him out and recapture that building. So, plan! Rush Titiana up there and just smack the shit out of him. Mission accomplished. Strike team. Ike, listen up. All this stuff is old news to me. But I can give a ricky like you a few tips. Shut up, boy. First off, don't yourself get worked up and jump out in front of everyone. You'll end up getting hurt. Like you got hurt yesterday by Grail and Mist. Yeah, the worst part is, uh, I just jumped right in front of him, and I didn't see I'd get hurt. I know. <laughs> Don't try to do too much, Ike. When things get dangerous, you can, and should, rely on us. I can run everybody except Boyd. Yeah, I agree. As long as you watch how the enemy moves carefully, you'll be fine. Think of this as a training mission. I'll do that. Oscar. Boyd. Thanks for your help. Don't mention it. Just sit back and watch how professional handles things. Yeah, you are right. watching. You boy to believe it. You boy to believe I'm about to beat up all these brigands. Enough chit chat, you three. We've got work to do. Leave it to the boy. Alright, before you engage an enemy, take a good look at his weapon. Um, it's um weird kind of metal on some stick. Okay. Me me metal stick. Metal, okay, he has a metal stick. Okay, well, what's the point of this? The weapon used often determines who has an upper hand in a fight. 
For example, the axe I'm wielding serves me well against lances, but it fares less well against swords. Okay, but what's metal stick strong against? I need to know. They'll tell us probably in a second. Oh yeah, you're right. And my lance is great against its swords, but not against axes. And to complete the triangle... Uh, metal sticks? <gasps> my sword is strong against metal sticks, but weak oh. against lances. Oh! Ike! Ike's coming in clutch! Oh, we could be all these metal stick enemies. Yes, exactly. If you can remember that, you'll be more effective in combat. That's just the basics, though. This will come in handy soon enough, so boy, forget it! Swords over axes. I won't forget. Not if I remember that. I'll always have the advantage over you, Boyd. <laughs> Boyd needed more <laughs> Do you think you could maybe find a different way of remembering? Yeah, thanks. Look, shut up with the snark, Boyd. And one more thing, don't forget to visit the locals. We're here to help after all. The villagers should welcome our presence. Get the fuck out of my village! You can't break in on the mercenary brigands! Uh, okay, so you so you probably have Boyd visit the house because he's fucking useless. No, I'm just kidding. You can have you should have Oscar visit the house. Because Lance is a weak to metal sticks. Uh you are right. Oh, you're with the mercenaries, right? Thank you for coming. Leave me alone! I'm, I'm busy! We've heard a lot about you. Here, take this weapon. It's dangerous to go alone. Take, take this. It. We're farmers, not fighters. Maybe you'll get some news from it. You got a steel sword. Ah. My horsey guy can totally use a steel sword. Now, Oscar, where should he go? Like, right here, maybe by Tatiana? Sure. Whatever you feel is necessary. <laughs> well, I feel like he's not good against fucking axe users, so... Well, just so you know, Tayana can destroy this whole map. Yeah, she she's like your set. So what you're saying is, I should solo the whole game with her. No, you, you should actually use Ike a lot on this map and other characters if you don't want them to fall completely behind, especially Ike. Yeah, because she is she gets like no experience for like half the game. Uh, let's just move her back here. You can use Oscar with that third person up there. You can move Boyd out a little bit. I'm moving right here. What's going on out there? Is, there, is that some sort of army? I don't know, Zawana. What do you think? Ha! A bunch of mercenaries looking for the next meal. The villagers must have hired them. Listen up, lads. Hard him and hard him bad. We let this bunch live and we'll have hordes of pirate swords hounding us for the rest of our days. It's those fool villagers. They think they can buy a bunch of sorcerers and chase us away? It ain't gonna work out how they want it. All they get for their trouble is a bunch of red houses. Tear them down, boys! I'll teach them a lesson! Oh, you just said I'll teach them. I don't think you can save that house, by the way. I don't think so. I think no one's scripted. Because unless you have Gale Force and an infinite hour of movement, I don't think you can make it to the house. And there's no Gale Force in this game, so. Okay. But you have to get to that house before that dude does, or that house is gonzo. Uh, So I can finish that dude off for the experience. So why don't I have Oscar move over yeah. here? Just have him wait. Yep. Um, I uh, iron sword or an iron sword? That has a lot of iron swords. He does, dude. Level up. Do zero res. Yeah, he doesn't need it. Yeah, you're probably right. Okay, Boyd. Move up right there. I 
Tiana. Have her move like right there. Yeah. Oh, red boy. This game has permadeath, right? Yeah. Okay. That's what I asked him, like, I'm so used to the more recent Fire Emblem games where, like, you can turn it on off my like, weight. It doesn't give you an option. Okay, so you have to get to the house this turn. Which I think Tachyana can. Can she? Wait, can Tachyana get there? Uh... I mean, yeah. yeah. she can. Go with Tachyana. Is it? I just figured, like, since those bandits took over, we can't even sleep at night. Please, help us save our village. Here, my mother left this. I hope it serves you well. Oh, okay, Sarah's room. That's pretty good. We're gonna make Ico Hmm? I said we're gonna make Ico P. Oh, uh, yeah, dude. He's our avatar character. Alright, now hit the sword dude with Lance, dude. After all, lances are strong against swords. Uh, that's why you didn't move Oscar there. Sir dude, right oh. there in front of in front of our boy boy. Oh yeah, yeah. So, so move him right there. Yeah. And attack, sir dude. Uh, look, I'm a little slow. If you couldn't tell. Is that I I do not pay attention like sword boy. Who? Oh. Um, now move him down a, a few pegs so he doesn't get hit by axe man here. And no, just right behind Ike. Yeah, right there. And I'll kill Sword Boy with Ike Boy. What does shoving do? Just like literally push them? It pushes them with face forward. Okay. Ike, you can't. Okay, there we go. I mean, you would have known that if you pay attention to um when it was telling you what it would do. Do you think I read? You should. You're playing no. Fire Emblem. No. There's Perma Death involved. Look, I guess I'm. Let me keep Boyd right there. Uh, check how far, um, Axe moves. Yeah, he can get hit regardless. You can leave him there. He can take a hit from Axe Dude. My work here is done! The house is totaled! Time to move on to bigger things! Now I smashed some mercen me some mercenaries! Oh boy. He looked at Ike and he's like, I'll kill this dude. He looks like an easier target. Oh shit! Oh, oh backstab! Boyd! Oh my god, he parried! Man, you don't get more insulted than that, that's for sure. <laughs> you have to heal Ike. Yeah. See if Oscar can kill the one Ike fought. But Austin gets in that sweet experience. Yep, even with weapon triangle disadvantage. Plus he misses. Twice. But she didn't. Oscar Meyer did his job. Boyd should be able to finish off the other bandit. Uh, you can move him kind of up. It's alright. I think there's another sword on that side. Yeah. You can move him there. Right here? No, no, for this point up. Here? Yes. Oh, yeah, because the boss won't move up. Yeah, the boss won't move. Yep, he kills if he hits. He did. Alright, Boyd, I'm sorry for calling you a bitch-ass little pussy. <laughs> you better, Boyd, you better... Oh, God, what was you it? better, Boyd, leave it! Yeah, you Boyd. better, Boyd, leave I beat your Boyd, ass! Boyd, or believe it, that's what it was. And then heal Ike with the bullet area. Should I move him up and then heal him? Yeah, you can move him up a little bit. I mean, he reaches the boss regardless. You can just leave him there. Whoops. Actually, no, move him back down. Keep, keep him down. Yeah. Keep him right here? Yeah. Just in case, because I don't want the sword dude to attack him. Gotta think about all of these things. And just end your turn. Man with Oscar Myers. I 
Again, here comes the hard part. You probably have to beat the boss with um, Taikiana. Because I don't think any of your current characters can take him on properly. So, first check out to see how much damage Ike deals if you attack him, how much damage he takes. So, 7 times 2 and you take 6. Actually, I can probably beat him. So, how much health does he have? He has 29 health. Yeah, it's oh, at yeah, the yeah. top in the right. So, if you do 6 damage, you get 16 and a 46 century. You have a 100% chance to hit 7 twice on him. Yeah. So, and he has no chance at a critical hit, so you can take 2 hits no matter what. Hmm. So you do 14 this turn and 14 on his turn, yeah. and then you would be able to kill him with your next attack on your turn. Alternatively, you can hit B, go back, go back, uh, go up to Oscar, and you can take the Iron Sword from him. No, you have to take oh. I, move him up, and turn. Trade? Yes. Or Steel Sword, I'm sorry, not Iron. So I'll just trade this. Trade him an Iron for a Steel. Well, you can, yeah, you have to wait now. Yeah. And then just end your turn with that. And then now see what you do with Steel Sword. Although it'll probably be a little worse because you probably won't double. Since Steel Swords are heavier, yeah. So that's Ten not even worth it over the 14 damage. Plus, he has a higher hit on you. It would be better to go with the Iron Sword. Yeah. I'll do that. Hey, you're nothing but a boy. Well, every brat needs a beating now and then. Are you ready for it? Yes, yeah, there's a Rana. Not today. If you want to run away, now's your chance. Damn, Ike! <laughs> Imagine that you're sassing me. Don't, don't that beetle. He had, he had two chances to hit you and he missed one. Rip. Just end your turn. Yeah. <laughs> no, I forgot he heals 2 HP. Yeah. It won't matter. He gives you 14 damage a turn. So he's gonna. Yeah, that's it. You just kill him oh, with yeah, an extra. Right. Yeah, yeah. I meant for better than this. I don't want to die here. Well, you are, so deal with it. Rip Zorana. Would have recruited you if I could. Just kidding, have enough boys on our team. <laughs> Level 4. Hell yeah, look at that. Nice suit. Total more nice suit. Iron Axe. And throw that shit in your convoy. Oh, that dropped it. I forgot you don't have a convoy yet. <gasps> It doesn't matter, <laughs> this is an iron axe. Yeah, I know. Uh, I'm dropping an iron sword, I can use those. And now you just have to move uh, into the red space. Oh yeah, so enter. Well, well technically I could probably move there. Oh, I, I thought I had to move Ike there. I don't know, you might have to move Ike there. I'm not giving that, yeah, red, no, no, yeah, we just wait, yeah. Yeah, you got to move her out. But yeah, enter turn. You now move her. That's back out, and then move Ike in. No. Seeds. He was like, we get to move a lord into there, right? Ike isn't a lord. He's a ranger. Look, I'm smart. That's the end of it. Ike, are you alright? Yeah, I would be fine. You, you know, know, you surprised me. I think you've come so far. Look at my father, though. I've still got such a long way to go. There's nothing you can do about it. After all, Commander Grail is... Can I grow his what? Huh? What about my father? Oh, nothing. Nothing? Now I'm really curious. Don't worry. You'll learn about it someday. Hey, Ike, that wasn't bad for your first battle. Not as flashy as my first battle, though. What, are you getting your ass beat for some fucking no, Not as his first time in bed. <laughs> yeah, you were a real standout. I never forget, I never forget the sight of you so keyed up, you broke your own axe. <laughs> Jesus. Oscar, dang it! You didn't have to bring that up! Damn, boy. 
Anyway, I congrats on finishing your first mission. Welcome to the group. Everyone's all right. Well, let's get going. I'm sure Miss has a nice hot meal waiting for us. You better boy leave him ready to you go. You better believe it. So we have been playing for 34 minutes apparently. Yeah. We're gonna beat this whole game by tomorrow, right? Hell yeah, dude. Hell yeah, dude. Chapter two. Rescue. Wait, are you off tomorrow? No. Oh well. <laughs> Oh, that's how you close it up. Yeah, close. Who is this mysterious character you've never met before? <laughs> it was Reyes! Oh, Titania. So this is where you've been, is it? Reyes, are you sure you're well enough to be up? Yes, my fever is completely gone. Are you sure? You still look a bit unsteady on your feet, if you ask me. Well, I've been in bed for almost a week. I doubt anyone would be in top form. Even you, my friend. Uh, I don't know about that! I certainly hope that's all it is. In any case, until you're back at full speed, you won't be doing any work. Damn. We're mercenaries, after all. And even the smallest lapse invites death. Right. I know, I know. My apologies to the rest of the team, then. It looks like I'll be recuperating for a while longer. Hmm. It's for the best. Take your time and get fully rested and restored. You are our sole staff wielder, Reese. The harder our work, the more we depend on you to be at our sides. Thank you for your kind words. Oh, by the way, the paper you've been carrying around? Is it a letter? A love letter? <gasps> I'd intended to go into town this afternoon. I can deliver it for you if you like. Oh, no. Th this letter is for you, Titania. Oh, damn, a love letter. For me? N not more than a little while ago. I went out for a walk around the yard. I was going to ask if you were by the tree in the back of the school. Oh, he's challenging her to a duel. Oh, shit, you're right. <laughs> a man I've never seen before came up and said, Give this to the Red Trest Knight. I thought that said Red Breasted Knight. I'm like, <laughs> how would he know what her things look like? <laughs> I'm curious. I wonder what it is. I imagine the thank you letter from the people of Caldia or something to that effect. Do die, I hate you. <laughs> oh, no. How dare they? I was right, yeah. Did you know what's the no. matter? What did the letter say? Reese, take this letter to Oscar until I prepare for combat and wait for me. I have to go out for a moment. Uh, but, Titania? I'll be right back. I'm counting on you. What on earth could that letter have said? Read the letter! <laughs> Read it, you illiterate fuck! I thought he said, I'm recuperating, but he's like, just dashes all the way back. Everyone, come quickly. Hey, Reese. So how are you feeling? What, what is it? Why are you so agitated? Has something happened? It's Mist and Rolf. They, they've been taken by bandits. Who is Rolf? Uh, he is a training character in this game. Who okay. uses the bow. Okay. What? He's also the son of a shepherd. Okay, so he's the shepherd, one shepherd from Elise then. Got it. <laughs> the game's so progressive, you predicted things eight years after this game came out. I <laughs> you know I was referencing that in that in. Oh! Oh! <laughs> damn it! I am the son of a shepherd! <laughs> Do you know how dumb I feel now? <laughs> what are you talking about? The two of them went out earlier this morning to gather wildflowers. Sure, they're not back yet, but... Earlier by the gate, a man asked me to deliver a letter to Titiana. It was a for, it was from a group of bandits, kidnappers, those dastards. What are we going to do? Let me see it. But you don't have your eyes open. How are you going to read it, Oscar? Oh, if only I'd known. He didn't seem like a bad person. Hm, I get it. They're after revenge. They want retribution for the other day at the village. Caldia, was it? Hmm. Taking Think. children as hostages? What, what cowards? cowards? Blast! Wait, Wait I... Ike, where, where do you think you're going? I'm gonna solo all of them! I'm a god! Don't worry about it! He is. <laughs> I'm going to get missed. But no. Titiana, she said she'd be right back. You're supposed to get ready and wait for her. And do you honestly think we've got time to wait? I'm going. 
What do you think you're going to do on your own, rookie? Hold it. I'm going too. I'm higher than level than you now, boy. Go fuck yourself. <laughs> you boy don't believe I'm coming with you. Jesus. <laughs> uh, stop, both of you. I, I'm going with you. Oh, oh come, come on. on. Wait, this is crazy. Do you think you can just ignore the deputy commander's orders? Damn right. The road forks here. Well, which way do we go? How am I supposed to know that? Hold it. Are you saying you don't know where we're going? Unbelievable. You better learn to think before you act, you moron. I don't want to end up you, boy. Shut your mouth, boy! <laughs> you think you can make me? Come on! I beat you in the training <laughs> mission, boy! Yeah, I try can make you! Learn your place, boy! <laughs> Have you seen Ike? He's a Super Saiyan God, Super Saiyan, before they fucking had those. Yeah, I know. That's how progressive these games are. Both, Both of you, Both this is no time to be fighting. I figured I... we'd find you like this. What are you two doing? So you're coming after all. It's not like you two chambermaids to be disobeying orders. What's the word coming to? Oscar, you know this road, don't you? Which way do we go? You're going to the Banner Stronghold, right? It's the left fork. How would you know that? I don't, I don't know. You're let's psyched. see, let's see. So, town's on the right, and... Oh, right, the left is the Bandit Stronghold. That's just a nat landmark, I know. Come on, Oscar, let's go, too. I guess, I guess we, we got no choice. choice. Uh, hey, you're not leaving me behind. There they are. You boy to wait for me! <laughs> Bandit, hold on! Boined it. Uh. So, you came, did you, boys? Is it just you then? You came alone? You seriously underestimate what we're doing? There's four of them. They didn't come alone, dipshit. Look, he's a brigand. Do you think he's that smart? He probably dropped out of school in the third grade like, I don't need me no education. I can count these here mercenaries on one hand. Hey, then, guys, one, one, of the, the, one of the final bosses in Three Houses is technically a brigand. Don't make fun of brigands. Look, I'm not I'm not saying all brigands are stupid. I'm just saying, Econo, this particular brigand is stupid. You're probably right. Looking at him, he probably is stupid. Look, look at that stupid. He tried to be Guile with his hair. He's like, I'm cool. I really like Guile. You he's better not come near me, boy. I have my Sonic Boom attack. Sonic Boom! <laughs> be careful. He flash kicks you. He plays a lot. He plays very stalling. No, nah, we're going to kick his ass. Now, where's that snobby red-haired wrench you were with? Wench, guy. <laughs> I got me this here snobby <laughs> red hair wrench with me. I keep it in my toolbox. Like Tanya is not here. It's just us. All I want to know right now is whether Mr. Rope or The son of the shepherd. <laughs> yeah, of course. We got him locked up safe and sound in that little shack back there, boy. We got no problem with those brats. What we're after is a little revenge. We want the red hair and her pups. That be you, boys. I guess that extra guy there who wasn't there before. <laughs> he ran right away. Then hurry up and let those two go. We're here, aren't we? You've got no more reason to hold them. You're here, but Red ain't. We'll just keep the brats until she arrives. Dang it. If you're so impatient, I guess we can start by killing you, whelps. You all ready to die? Hey! Come on now! It's time to play, lads! Whoosh. Oh, so, so does he crack a whip when he's like, oh, blah! No, that's how fast he swung that axe. Oh, shit. There. there are so many. But we must not lose. Riss, move to the rear. If anyone gets injured, we'll need you on a hand with your staff. Understood. Understood. Take them, lads! Without the red-haired knight, they're no match for us! I mean, I killed half your troop. He doesn't oh, know that. He uh, ran away. What'd you say, dirtbag? We'll Ooh. make you regret those wards! Look, he's running away again! Okay, so click on sword dude up there. You need to keep his range in mind. Because he couldn't fuck up your day. 
but we'll see. Three. Okay, maybe. You can probably take him on with Oscar, to be honest. He is a surgeon. Plug the 10 damage. Yeah, fuck it. Oscar Meyer, do your best. <laughs> now. The horse is so strong, you didn't take the hit from that sword. Move in front of him. Or actually, or I guess, yeah, move one space down. So, right here? Yeah. Okay. I think it makes it a little harder for him to move. Well, probably not. I guess he moves here. Okay, check his move range. And check the other sword dude's move range. Okay, so... You can move Boyd back and let the bandit come to you. Like right here? Yeah. Right here. Yeah, one space back should be fine. Wait. Oh, that's also fine. Whatever. Oh, I heard one space back. Oh, yeah, you can just end your turn. Boris is outside of range. The third dude should die to Oscar and then uh, that deal will fight it. Oh, sniff. Keep your chin up, Rolf. Boys aren't supposed to cry. Be a good son of a shepherd. But I'm so scared, aren't you aren't you even a bit scared, Mist? Of course I am, but listen, we'll be fine. My brother will definitely come rescue us. Uh you're yeah, you're right. And I'm sure that my brothers will be right there with him. I'm sure they will too. So, no more crying. Got it? Yep, there he goes, right under to his death. Just fucking tremble. Check Axe Dude's movement. Okay, so he cannot hit Ike right now. It doesn't matter. I thought he could. He just moved right there. No, that's his attack space. So oh. go like go to an enemy, like just hover over them. You see how it shows the orange spaces? Oh, yeah, that, yeah. So yeah. the end is where they can attack. Oh. So one space behind is how far they can move. Oh. Uh, how far can you move Oscar? Not very far. Uh, don't put him in the range of the axe, dude. Right here? Uh, no. The other corner. This one? No, down. 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 One more. Right there. Right here? Yes. Okay. Make sure you said the other corner. Which corner? This one? That one? Uh, click on the sword, dude. I want to make sure you can hit Wiz. Okay, yeah. That's fine. Uh, you can heal Ike if you want to get rid of the two damage. That would give Wiz experience. There you go, I mean the third dude will probably attack Ike, but that doesn't really matter. You can tear the friggin' next turn. So you can just end your turn there, yeah. Alright. Alright, Ike's an unkillable god. Yep, as per usual. Yeah, Ike is like the be one of the best starting character lords you get in the game. I mean, I can tell that he's fucking wrecking the shit right now. I'm, I'm sure I told I told him to wait for me. I should have known the disobey orders. They have no discipline. As deputy commander of the Grail Mercenaries, I cannot allow any more of my people to be harmed. Our people. Don't don't worry. I haven't been harmed at all. Uh, should I have Ike attack the axe guy? Yeah, let's see how much damage he does. Iron sword. Yeah, you kill him. If you want to just kill him, that's fine. Yeah, I might I'd as say. well. It's just XP, so yeah. I can have Riz just heal him if I need. Yeah, no. Well, I mean, it's like, 
you know, if you want boy to get experience too, you eventually need to fight something. Yeah. What level is he? Level two? Yeah. yeah I'm gonna have that. What are these do I have? One, two, three, four, and then the leader. Yeah. Alright, so I guess. Actually. And as long as you don't move to that area, you should be fine. Uh, okay. And yeah, that's about his maximum movement, so. Yeah. And again, if you want to give Wiz of experience, you can um, raise. You just heal Ike. Yeah, might as well do. <laughs> do I need Riz later on? There's other mm -hmm. healers. Like Mist. Probably attack Boyd if you move him there. So if you want to move him there and just let him attack Boyd, I mean he can kill Boyd after he attacks him. Yeah. Boyd. And I doubt he's killing Boyd. Oh yeah, probably not. Should he pass there? Uh, no, move like forward. Oh yeah. Smart. Right here? Uh, no, one space back. Yeah, right there. Okay. And then click on the bandit after. Okay, I move a uh, whiz to a space that isn't one of those orange spaces. Uh, you might want to click on him so you can see. Best thing I need to do is get him killed. Right here? Or like right here? Right there. Right there? Yeah, that's perfect. Okay. Okay, now end your turn. If he's attacking that after I dodge. They're about 8 damage, and then Boyd missed. Now Boyd leaving this one. Okay, check how much Boyd would do if he attacked. And hit. Wow, he missed a 77% chance to do it. can go back. Uh, select your attack one with Oscar. Yeah, do that. Yeah, so then... Yeah, and then you can finish him with Boyd, and Boyd would get a majority of the experience. Yeah. Oh, so like, this is how you do it, Boyd! You dodge! You don't miss them! Just move, move back to Wiz. Over here? Yeah. That way if something does happen, Wiz is still blocked up. Wiz is still blocked up. Oh, yeah. Okay. Seventy-seven, my ass. Okay, just kill the dude with Ike. Hey, we gave we gave Boyd a chance. We're just not Boyd leaving this time. Yeah. And he'll Boyd with um Riz with Riz, yeah. Pass? Yep, just that. No, move. Who's his next one? Probably another axe. This guy's a steel axe. So the furthest he can attack is right there. So just move your characters forward. Well, even if I can range, you'll probably kill, to be honest, but... Yeah. Do that. Just in case something happens. Okay, see how much damage Boyd does to him first. 
13 if he hits. I'm gonna go back. See how much damage Oscar does to him. Move him behind. Yeah, right. Yeah, was that right there? 20. Okay, do that. And then attempt to finish him with Boyd. Yes. Oh, God. Alright, Oscar's coming in clutch more than Boyd. Yeah, I know, he has a weapon disadvantage. <laughs> Boyd, you're like, oh, Boyd, I hope I hit this guy! Eh! Move one space up. Actually, Here? no, over. Here? Yeah. Now hit the dude with the Boyd. Boyd dies first. <laughs> Hopefully not. I don't want but to if you lose a character, it'll probably be Boyd. I prefer not to lose anybody. Yeah, because we're restarting the map if you lose someone. Yeah. Okay. Okay, check how far the swordsman moves down. So he can attack. He can't Oscar. move that far. Or that that's fine. How far does the swordsman move down? My swordsman, my bad, I misunderstood. Okay. I, I was looking so the surge vein couldn't hit boys. Yeah, well, I'm fucking stupid. So I saw swords were like a big axe man use sword. Okay, yeah, well, I mean Oscar's probably gonna be fine judging from the last two people who attacked him. Move Ike forward to the green space. Here? Yeah, right there. And move um rays behind him. You don't really have to move Tidiana, but yeah. you can if you want. Uh, I think she'll be fine at the back. Alright, cool. Another victim to kill with Boy. Right here? No, other side. Here? Yep. If you fucking miss, I'm gonna get really mad. Yata, he actually leveled up. Never thought I'd see the screen today. <laughs> okay, uh, strong thirty, dude. Okay. Uh, just move Oscar up a space. Here? Yeah. Pass. Wait. Yeah, oh, wait. Yeah. Or wait, like, wait, do what? Oh, yeah. Click on the circuit again. I'm pretty sure it didn't change his range. Okay, good. Now move ways behind and heal him. I don't know why you keep turning the range off after. I, I leave it on. Actually, you know what? Just. Oh yeah, no, that's fine. You can leave it there. Yes, yeah. pass. I'm out. Still the void. <laughs> you hate killing him with void. I'm telling you that right now. <laughs> you kill him with thoughts. Your boy already can't hit someone with an axe. I think it's hit someone with a weapon triangle advantage over him. Yes. Right, and get Ike ready to kill the boss. You move Oscar forward. Okay. Just not just not two spaces around the boss. Is that right here? Yeah, that's fine. Go up to the boss. Okay, he only has an iron axe. He's not gonna move. No, you don't have that turn on the train. You never move. Here? Oh, one more space up. There. Yeah, right there. Yeah, most of these bosses have like hand axes, so I'm just yeah. checking. But, um, go to, uh, Is Boyd. Is something here? Or the heal? It hit, it's heal. Oh. Cool. Yeah, if you move that space, it'll give you some HP. Should move Boyd up? Yeah, move Boyd up. Here? One more. And then move. Way raise into any green space. Yeah, right, right there. there. Perfect. And you can. Yeah. Oh. It does move. Bosses oh. that move. Never thought I'd see the day. 
Grah, we won't lose. Not for the likes of you! Ten damage, Jesus. Eleven damage, ooh. Void's flexing on him. Damn, Void! Okay, fuck up his day with Ike. Right here? Yep. Eighteen. Nah, that's fine. Void can get the kill. They probably need the XP. Will you let the two of them go now? Sure. sure! You can have them both! If you can beat me, that is! Well, at least he's on a war about it. Right, boy could probably kill him now. How much points hit on him? 73. <laughs> I don't like the odds, let's do it. Never tell me the odds. This. This can't be! I don't deserve to lose a cell sword like you! You better boy leave you lost to me! Ugh! Slifer Sludge! <coughs> nice. She had 11 last speed second. Win. Oh, yeah, we didn't get the Seraph rub and the speed ring from them and give them the Ike so he's even more OP. Oh, yeah. Somehow? What do you mean, somehow? We did it because we're better than them. Well, all of us except Boyd are better. Yeah, I agree. Boyd, calm yourself. What you did was in direct defiance of the orders I explicitly gave you. How it all turned out is another issue altogether. Deputy Commander, I take full responsibility. The failure is mine. Except our apologies. Oscar, Reese, what am I supposed to do with you two? Fire them! Sigh. I think I'll leave you two with the commander. He'll know how to handle you, I'm sure. Now, let's find Mist and Rolf. No, you know do that? According to the bandit chief, they're in the shack back. Eek! What? Mist! <coughs> Please, let us go! I said let us go! Mist. Brother! Everyone! You came! Who's that? In the tree line over I there. I see that. <laughs> oh, I'm scared. Rolf! Oscar? Help me! Leon, help! Ashley! <laughs> Leon! <laughs> Rolf, I'm here too! Oh, uh, and boy, boy's here. Boy! Wow! Wow! Boy's here! What's up, Brian? You don't need to worry. We'll get you out of there. That's that right. Back up, bud. Fuck up, buddy. Oh, I'll try. You harm either of them, and I'll see you dead. I ain't gonna be dead anyway. Shut up. Shut your stinking trap. If you want these two alive, you'll throw your weapons down. If you don't, I'll start with the girl. Come. Eek! No! Stop. Wait. Huh? Yeah? I'm putting down my weapons. See? <laughs> Smart move, wrench. <laughs> wrench. <laughs> Deputy Commander. We're here to save them. Now all of you back off. Okay. Dang. This stings. <laughs> Alright, so now you're all unarmed. Which means... All you can do is watch while I've got this whiny brat like a fat ring pig! Ugh. Ah! Ugh! Ah. Ah. <coughs> Bacchina! Ugh! Ugh! Rolf! Can you hear me? Mist! Is Rolf? Is he? He's fine. He just fainted is all. There's not a scratch on him. Whew. Don't do that to me. I'm just glad to see you both alive and well. You're both so brave. Yep. Thanks. This guy's dead. This arrow, who shot it? A single arrow, right between the eye. Who else can make a shot like that? No one! That's who! That voice! Don't you children owe me a little gratitude? I did just save your lives. Deputy Commander Shinon, ha ha, 
You're both so cruel. With this armor on, you know I can't run that fast. Shinon, Gotri! So that's where you ran, Kaikiana. Of, of course. I knew we need reinforcements. I'm glad it wasn't a waste of time. Well done, both of you. In the end, I got to feather someone, so it was worth the rush. All I did was sweat. That was hard. Good. God for the embodiment of you. Yeah. Brother! Brother! Miss, you did well, sis. You must have been frightened. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh -uh, I never uh -uh. stopped believing. I knew that you Yellers would come and rescue us. I knew you'd come. So, I was fine. Really? That's an improvement on your usual sobbing and, no and nose running. Damn. You jerk. I. My nose does not run. Alright, come on. Let's head for home. My goodness, what a day this has been. Save it and we're gonna call this an episode. Yes. You've been playing for an hour. An hour! Woo! Woo! Uh, no, stop game, stop, 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 stop. It. Stop. stop it. Uh, anyway, guys, this is gonna be all for this episode. We're gonna come back to Pirates of Ground in Chapter 3. This is you, Steve. Thank you, Corey. And this has been Fire Emblem Path of Radiance. Bye! Bye.